Hi everybody, I'm Dahlia. Welcome into this very special stream where we're going to be playing the Mothman Equinox event, doing our dailies, and overall just hanging out together, having a great time. Thank you so much to the community members who were here early waiting for stream to start. Welcome into Sniperman Boss, Lucas Booze, Labyrinth, The Hardy Heathen, DMH Flip. Thank you so much, everybody, for being here. Labyrinth says, I'm traveling to Atlantic City to see the killer clown. What? I want to see that. What's a killer clown? Is that part of the new content that I haven't played yet? So, here's my main character. I'm going to go ahead and start up a group, and anybody who wants to join me, come on, let's go. Lucas says, the mayor's server is full for me. Ugh. Oh, no. It is. It does look very full. Should we all jump servers? Let's see. I'm going to go ahead and create the team. Let me know if you can't get in after a few minutes. Got DMH flip so far. Hi, Hardy Heathen. How you doing? It's great to see you. Another option is, Lucas, if you just randomly join a server, we could all join you. That might be faster and easier. Let me know when you've done that. We'll just jump over to where you are. Because this server looks really full. So then if anybody else wants to come in too, it's going to be hard. Hi, Bernie. Hi, Petra. Great to see you. How you doing? Looks like we're about 30 minutes off from the next big event. But we could go to this. Oh, I'm over encumbered. That's okay. I've got this. This will help me get ready for my day. I'm going to scrap some stuff. Like an assault rifle. Buttressed, strengthened. I don't need any of that. Just get rid of all this. Just don't accidentally scrap your power armor. Because that's always a bad deal. Nero Toxic Dust. Oh, Lucas Boo's joined the team. Good. So we, we do have room for you, Mayor, if you need a team. How are you today, Bernie P? Are you enjoying some Fallout 76? And how about you, Petra? Are you going to find some time to jump in with us? What have you been playing lately? So much to scrap. So much to scrap. Ooh, wooden legs. I really should save that wooden stuff. Let's see if we can get Mayor, too. Mayor's in the team? Ah, Mayor's in the team. We got everybody. Yay. Petra says, I've been playing Terra and Honkai Star Rail. Nice. That's epic. Bernie P says, I'm just about to go online. Well, feel free to add me if you want. It seems like this server's a little full, but I'd love to play with you either today or whenever. Honkai Star Rail is fun. I played it a little bit. I was thinking about possibly doing a sponsorship for it too, but I'm not sure if I will or not. I haven't decided. Oh, I shouldn't put my junk in here. Let me see. I accidentally put stuff in here that doesn't go in here. I do want to keep this. I do want to keep this too, darn. I'm just so disorganized. Bone shards. I think. Let's see. Bernie pieces, I'll look you up. Yeah. Are you enjoying the new content? Hi, I like cheese. How you doing? Everybody, please go give a follow to I Like Cheese. 
They are an awesome content creator. Carlisle typewriter, cat bowl. I don't need that. I don't need this. Circuits. Copper scrap. Cork scrap. Crystal shards. Digested goo. Excessive adhesive. Fiberglass spool. I think technically I don't need the dog tags. Fuse. Glass shards. Gold fork. Gold plated flip lighter. I have a lot more gold in here than I would have thought. Don't want this. Don't want that. Oh wait, I want the house teapot. Drats. This is kind of hard. <laughs> Don't accidentally put your junk in your in your stash box and when you have fallout first, it's hard to clean up. Loose springs, molded plastic. Then again, I'm a junk collector. Maybe not everybody collects as much junk as I do. I like to collect toys in this game. That's something I've done for years, is collect toys. As you can see, I have quite the toy collection. I guess I need that. Steel scrap, 350, that's a lot. Waste acid. Waste antiseptic, waste oil. Wood scraps and wrench. I think that should be all. Bernie P says, loving it. See you on the other side. Yeah. Lucas says, my game is in Portuguese because of Windows. I won't change now. Too lazy to log off. <laughs> well, that'll be fun to see how it translates to Portuguese, I guess. Scrap box. Alright, I think that's good. Now I just need to sleep. I wonder if I need to make more cranberry relish here at the beginning of today because I think I might have eaten my last cranberry relish yesterday. It is possible. I have to get my well-rested bonus. Did I get it yet? There it is. Silver, hi. Aw, I'm so sorry, Silver. I hope that your family is able to honor her memory. I'm sorry for your loss. How you doing otherwise? I hope you had a nice Easter dinner. I think I talked to you on Easter, didn't I? Yeah, you had a good Easter dinner. You had roast beef. We had this conversation. <gasps> Lucas! Thank you so much for becoming a holographic member. Oh my gosh, you rock. So everybody, in case you didn't already know, on top of liking the stream and subscribing to follow the channel, you can also join and become a member, get access to members only streams, my unique made by me emotes, and all sorts of extra special benefits. One benefit is a heart on the wall of heartness. So thank you so much, Lucas, for becoming a member. And I think you're also the first heart on the wall of heartness for the month. So that's pretty epic too. Because we're doing the Mothman event, and that's pretty goth. I'm going to go ahead and give you a black heart in honor of this event. There it is. Thank you for becoming a member, Lucas. 
Labyrin says, you should go to the boardwalk and break into the locked sheds near the bird bird bird. Okay. Let's go do that for fun, I guess. Does that mean he's a hologram now? Yeah, he's a member of the hologram fam. Lucas Booze. YouTube member. Yay. Heartness. Now let's put it up on the wall. Love the membership short video. Thanks. I'm going to redo it at some point. I literally made that in like two seconds on my phone with like, you know, one of those kind of very basic video editors and i was just like okay here's this and this and this done <laughs> and i put it up <laughs> it was very quickly made silver says i only met her a few times but i feel bad for my cousin and they are 10 to 12 years younger than me yeah for sure i'll keep your cousin in my thoughts and prayers and everything that's a terrible loss for them So let's see. You're going to be the very first heart on the wall of hearts. So where do you think we should put it to start? Hmm. How about like this? That seems right, doesn't it? Thank you, Lucas. Heartness. Woohoo! Most excellent. Effects, items, food and drink. Looks like I need to make more cranberry cobbler. I mean cranberry relish, so go ahead and pour it here. Look, it says such an honor, the very first. Yeah! Heartness. Congratulations, Lucas. You broke Labyrinth's streak. Labyrinth had the first heart for the last few months in a row. He had a First heart streak. Now it goes Labyrinth, Labyrinth, Lucas. In fact, it might even go Labyrinth, 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 Lucas. Come back, wolf pack leader. Hey, you think you're just gonna run away from me that easy? I think I forgot to turn the regular music back on. Settings, audio, music. That's too loud. But it sounds better than quiet. One, two, three. There we go. Just need some background music. DMH Flip is here! I have to make my cranberry relish. Dink. It requires cranberries. Boiled water and gore. Also, some sugar. Okay, I just realized did I 
Okay, I need to make sure I use my score boost. I haven't put my score boost on. Good thing I checked. I hate playing for a long time and not realizing my score boost is down and then losing like extra score because of it. When I'm aggressively hitting the score season score pass, I try to always have a score boost on. I really like that that's something that they give away now pretty frequently in there because it means I can save my atoms for things I actually want, like different cosmetics. Nice! Congratulations, Lucas! So, Lucas, are you going to try the permadeath server with me? Who wants to try the permadeath server with me? DMH Flip, do you want to try the permadeath server with me? You know I mean business because of what I'm doing with my eyebrows. <laughs> that means that means very important, serious business. Hi. All right, now I'm going to port to my other house way over here. If I do this fast enough, I might be able to even hit that event that's going on. Lucas says, can I try with my main character? You cannot. You have to make a character specifically for the challenge. Part of the rules is that you have to start at level 2, fresh out of the vault. Now, the good thing is, because it's on a separate world, like one of the custom worlds, there's a button you can push to unlink it and reset it. If you die, then you don't have to like delete the character. You can just unlink it and it'll reset it. But you have to start with a fresh level 2 straight out of the vault character. Also, there's no legendaries or anything. And everything's set to like as difficult as possible. So it's a super hard mode permadeath server. And it's competitive. I've been spending a lot of time on it. Because it's so fun! I'll probably do a... I haven't decided yet. I haven't decided if I am going to do a regular play with everybody stream tomorrow here on YouTube or if I'm going to do a permadeath server. Because, like, here's the thing. I don't want to confuse people who are really enjoying the hardcore run because it's different. The hardcore run's been going since August, which is, like, way before this server was ever even created. And I, I kind of want to keep, like, the interest and the hype around my hardcore run going, so... I'm a fr I don't know, I hesitate to bring the permadeath content here at this time, because that run's going so well and I don't want people to get confused. But I am already making content about it on Twitch. So let's see... I'll think about it overnight. I might just play regular Fallout 76 tomorrow, but we'll see. I mean, I guess I could do an extra day of the hardcore run. We did miss some. Where the heck is Raleigh's bunker? I accidentally... like, ran out of... gourd. Sniper Man Boss says, I took out a raider with an explody muffin. What a bad muffin. Lol. <laughs> and thanks everybody for liking the stream today. You rock. Super duper heartness. Thank you for all the likes. And thanks for being here. Let's go in! This is opened with a terminal. Access denied. Access denied. 
Team Age Flip says, I have plenty of gourds at my camp if you want. Okay. Social, DMH flip. Now I have to find your camp. Mm -hmm. That's Lucas. I'm the mayor. Ah! DMH flip. Let's go! Okay, Lucas, I'm so happy that we're playing together. Yay! It's been a, lot, a long time since Lucas had time to come play with us. He used to play with us almost every time we we did this. So welcome back, friend. South near Foundation. Oh yeah, I remember this place. This place is cool. Gord. Oh, do I not have my card on? What the heck? I was doing daily challenges and didn't put my card back on. Sucks for the cranberries too, but I guess that's okay. It's not that big of a deal. I should probably plant a bunch of gourds. Um, I guess this is all I'll take for now. But I should probably plant a bunch of cords at my new house. Is there water nearby here? Ooh, is this the thunderstorm one? I want this. I was seriously thinking about buying extra atoms just to get this. Thunderstorm storm one OP. What am I missing for what I want to make? Missing sugar! I went through a period where I had so much sugar and now it's all gone. Well, let's go get some sugar, everybody. Sugar, do 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 do. Oh, honey, honey, do 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 do. You are my candy girl, and you got me wanting you. Do do do. Bernie says, "What's your name on Fallout?" It is that underscore. Dahlia, and everyone's welcome to invite me to be a friend. I accept all friend invites. Sniper Man Boss says, Us gamers don't get old. We level up. Heck yeah. Sugar do 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 Oh, honey, honey, do 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 You are my candy girl. And you got me wanting you. Do, do, do. Woohoo! Hey, who are you shooting at? Don't be shooting at me. Hardy Heathen says, You don't need no sugar. You're already so sweet. Aw, Hardy Heathen. You're sweet. <laughs> Hardy says, Also, that song hits different when the gal with the chainsaw is singing it while murdering robots. I love that. Let's see. Where can I find some sugar? Let me put some stuff in here. I just want to point out that everybody's still using two seasons ago trailer because it was the best. 
best trailer I ever seen. It is my favorite tent for sure, actually. No cat. All right, let's get snap tail, which I'm gonna turn into sugar. La 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 run 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 dooby 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 doo Looks like somebody else may have recently done this journey. A lot of these are already picked. Uh oh, that one's already picked too. It's okay, I got this. Exiting fertile soil, oh no! Snipey says, Dolly's on a quest to show the bad guy who's the best. Has been put to the test all day long. Dolly needs to rest. All those bloody raiders, what a mess. Dolly roaming around the waste land in a red dress. Yeah, I love that. <laughs> That's epic, Snipey. Thank you for another awesome rap about my game. I love it when you make little raps about my game. <laughs> Dolly's on a quest to show the bad guys who's the best has been put to the test all day long. Dolly needs to rest. All those bloody raiders, what a mess. Dolly roaming around the wasteland in a red dress. Ugh. I stuttered a little, but I got way faster that time. Sniper Man boss says, right? I did rap in high school. You're very talented with it. I love it when you drop some rhymes in the chat. Maybe I could sing it like, I'm the- I'm on a quest to show the bad guy who's the best. I've been put to the test all day long and I need to rest. All those bloody raiders, what a mess. Roaming around the wasteland in a red dress. That actually kind of flowed. Practice makes perfect. I hear power armor. It's Lucas! Hi! <laughs> it's been so many days since I saw your smiling face in the game. I hope I get this all done before the Mothman event. Uh oh, super mutant! Let's kill him! Uh oh, all my armor's breaking! <laughs> I died! I'm bad at this. Just kidding. <laughs> Good thing this isn't the permadeath run. It's always amazing to me, like how careless I am in my regular game, and then I can, like, keep two permadeath characters going at the same time. <laughs> and then in this one, I'm just like, Blah! No armor! Let's go! Super mutant! Yeah! Die! <laughs> 
balance. You guys can even create a rapper nickname, Sniper B and Hollow D. Ooh, I love that. <laughs> well, we already determined I'm the ho, so maybe we should just make my rapper name the ho. <laughs> AKA Hollow D. <laughs> that was from like last stream or the stream before we determined that if you take the first two letters of Dahlia and Hologram, my nickname is Da Ho. <laughs> Are you okay? I don't think I have loot here, do I? Oh, I do. I mean, I don't need that stuff, but. There was loot, nonetheless. Now I need more sugar ingredients. Silver says, that is so funny and so wrong. <laughs> I'm okay with it. <laughs> I think calling me a ho is funny. Because I'm a hologram and it's literally impossible for me to be that. So it's got some irony. It's a joke in itself. This guy's all like buggy. You know what else is wrong? Earlier, my friend wrote me on Discord and they were like, I have been, uh, voluntold that I'm playing Helldivers 2 tonight. And I was like, have, or I was like, have fun being drug into hell. <laughs> and I was like, that sounded way w worse than I meant it, but it was also appropriate and funny. <laughs> kind of like the hoe. <laughs> as soon as I said that, I felt bad. I was like, I hope they don't think I'm really saying they should get drug into hell. <laughs> but don't tell me you're getting voluntold to go do hell divers and not have me make some joke like that. Party Heathen says, oh god, I forgot about the host stuff. I almost fell out of my chair. <laughs> Sugar do 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 oh honey honey you were my candy girl and you got me wanting you do 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 I'm gonna make so much sugar and then I'm gonna give it all to the honey. The Mothman Equinox is now! Oh no, I don't have time to make any more sugar. Hold on. Oh, I have to make sugar first. That's right. I was like, why can't I make it?
Nothing worse than getting ads on your own PC while you're streaming. That's obnoxious. Apparently I forgot to shut off my Adobe stuff before stream. I always try to turn it off because it usually sucks resources in the background. Come on! Controller's disconnecting again. Let's go! Come on, Vominos! Everybody, let's go! I want that. I want this. Ah. Out of boiled water. But I think I just got a bunch of water. The image flip says Mothman time. I'll be right there. Uh oh, I don't want to use the sugar on that. Stash box. Let's put the sugar and the boiled water in here. Put whatever needs to go in there and there. Whatever needs to go in here and here. As you can see, I was playing for a long time yesterday and did not clean up after myself. This has been quite problematic. Let me put this in there. I think we're finally on track. How is my well-rested effect? Already gone? Oh yeah, because I died. Lucas says, uh-oh, I disassembled my left arm by accident. Lol, I made another one. I'm happy you were able to make another one, Lucas. Sniperman boss says, Rhymes in the chat. Dahlia took out bad guys with a baseball bat. Dahlia slaughtering a big giant rat. Cooking some dinner while I sat. I need to brush off my floor mat. <laughs> Alright. Time to finally do a Mothman event. I think we're only going to get two during this stream because unfortunately it seems like I missed the one that was closest to the beginning of the stream. Just barely. By like 10 minutes or something. Why am I exiting the event? I need to put on my funny outfit for this. Ritual clothes I can put on for this. Alright. Now that we're dressed like a freaky cultist, let's go! Cultist with the chainsaw! Whee! 
Oh, I need to eat my food. That we just threw, went through all that trouble to make. Lucas has a flamethrower! I'm following Lucas. I'm a cultist now, Lucas. That means I chainsaw people. looks a little bit like he doesn't belong here. That person's name is Gaming Granny. I love that. I hope when I'm an old granny, I'm a gamer. I'm sure I will be. It'll probably become more and more common. Ha ha ha! Lucas says, you were following me and I was following you. Teamwork! Return to the roof of the museum! Okay. Let's go meet the Mothman. Do you guys want to go meet the Mothman? Just go towards the people dancing the weird, um, religious dance. Ah! <laughs> I landed with the Mothman. <laughs> Hardy says, oh, I will be a gamer till the day I die. Same. Labyrinth says, I'm a mod for Gaming Granny's sister, too. Oh, nice. I didn't know Gaming Granny was a streamer. That's so cool. Who's her sister? I'll sell this, I guess. Sandra D76. Ah, nice. I just saw her here, too. That's so cool. <laughs> What's this rumor I hear about plans from this event? So, what people are saying, and I think Bethesda has technically confirmed it, uh, because they did an official announcement in the Discord, is... If you learn the plan when you first get it, for some reason, instead of giving you an alternate plan, the, 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 the following events will just give you nothing. Like, so it's being recommended that until this is fixed, you just don't eat your plans. And if people, since a bunch of people have already eaten the plans, Bethesda's talking about possibly extending the event for a week because they're not going to be able to fix it until the 8th. So I've just been stashing all the plans I get and throwing them in 
my stash box for the time being. Yeah, it's kind of a bummer. Hi. <laughs> you look awesome. <laughs> Scrap box. Don't eat, but I am hungry. I decided I have to lose weight, so I've been on a diet. I got a little bit lazy with my workout routine, and I got really in the habit of eating a lot. Like, I let myself start to eat a lot for holidays, and then I just never stopped. And I've been doing things like buying an entire cake and eating the entire cake. <laughs> And I'm like, alright, well, I've done this to myself. <laughs> you know what I mean? Now it's time to work out and go on a diet. I do, I love your mismatched power armor. <laughs> it's freaking epic. Do you like my cultist outfit? Miss DMH Flip says, ah, okay, I just keep getting the same Enlightened Hood plan. I think I have three now. Did you eat it the first time? Because maybe that's what the bug is. Maybe they just keep giving you the same one. Because isn't this one where you can't trade them? Let me look. DMH Flip says, I might have. But yeah, apparently there's some error there with that. Notes. What did I get this time? See, I haven't eaten any of them, because lucky for me, I heard about this before I did the first one. So I've been getting different stuff. Cultist Backpack, Cultist Eventide Hood, Mothman Equinox so Souvenir Beer Stein. But yeah, I've been really careful to not eat any of the plans, and I've been getting different things. So I'm just saving everything until the 8th, when they fix it. And it doesn't look like I've gotten any... Oh yeah, I've gotten two of the beer steins. But that's the only double I've gotten. Silver says, also, I've seen a lady who had to be in her 50s or 60s playing drums. She did not look like a rocker, but she was playing bands like Disturb. That's epic. Joshua Reese says, happy Wednesday night, everyone. Hope you're all having a blessed and amazing, wonderful evening so far. It's so good to see you, Joshua Reese. What you been up to? Lucas says, I ate my plans right after the event. Yay! <laughs> Aww. But it says in the message on the chat, don't eat the, don't eat the plans. Have you heard the event is bugged? Save your plans and don't eat them yet till it's fixed. And 44% of people said, no, thanks for telling me. 6% says, I don't care, I eat the plans anyway. Was that you, Lucas? <laughs> DMH Flip says, I think the first one I got was the brown honeycomb, honeycomb mothman. So, yeah, I don't know. I mean, like, obviously, there's nothing anyone can do about this, I guess. And if you're already eating them, no big deal. They are going to try to, um, make it better by adding another week or something. I don't know if that's been confirmed yet. They just said they were talking about it.
Party Heathen says, I was one of those I eat them anyway, but as you know, I also don't play the game. <laughs> Lucas says, what can I say? I'm a plant eater, I guess. Hi, Fenrir. Welcome in. How are you? It's great to see you. Everybody, Fenrir is a Skyrim and Elder Scrolls creator here on YouTube. Please go give him a sub and show him some gardening love. So what's next, everybody? Daily challenges. Scrap junk to produce screws. Collect death claw eggs. Consume a vintage alcoholic beverage. Craft or scrap a piece of power armor. Cripple a scorched leg and kill a glowing creature. What should I re... What should I re-roll today? Mmm... This one. Come on, come on, epic, 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 epic. Oh, it's not epic. Wanna try again? Let's see if I have a vintage alcohol beverage first, because I think I have one, but if that's on another tune, that's gonna suck. Oh yeah, I've got some. Vintage Meyer Magic Moonshine. I mean, it's kind of dumb because it just gives me like 100% gulper damage, which I don't need, but it is technically one. Vintage Nuka Shine. This is more what I was hoping for. Although, I mean, why do I even have these? Let's just go ahead and drink it. It's vintage. Yay! Woo! At least it makes me feel funny. I like the way it makes the world look. This is cool. Being drunk on vintage stuff is fun. Yay! Fenrir says, I'm doing well, thanks. Nice. Happy to hear that. Happy to hear that. Just seen Matrix 5 is in the works and they're rebooting the X-Files show. Don't know if it will still be Mulder and Scully or new characters, but certainly none of the old actors. That's kind of interesting. I would definitely like to see a rebooted X-Files. I used to watch that when I was a child. It was way too scary for me, but I watched it anyway and I had nightmares. <laughs> and I loved it. And I had a huge crush on David Duchovny when I was a little girl. So... That'll be cool to see a reboot of that. And let's see. I don't know. Matrix 5 would be cool. Except for I think the only Matrix I ever saw was the first one. So I have some catching up to do on those. Apparently. Before I'm going to be ready to watch <laughs> the rest of them. Let's go to my other house. This one. Silver says, I love X-Files. I used to love X-Files too. I still remember some of the episodes that scared me the most about it. Woodland Retreat. What's up? Where can I put a, a garden? Oh! I have... Uh-oh, what's going on? My OBS froze. Hmm. Give me just a second, everybody. Alright, it looks like it's back. So, okay. Although it's lagging again. Why does it do this sometimes? Yay! Let me see if turning off the camera helps. Doobie doo boo 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 doo boo 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 doo boo doo boo 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 doo boo boo doo boo doo boo doo 
do 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 Thanks, Lucas! Joshua Reese, what have you been doing lately? It's so nice you're able to make it into stream tonight. Hi, Adelaide. Do I have any gourds left? I want to plant gourds. I do, I have eight gourds. Should we plant them inside or outside? Maybe outside, but in the cool thingy that I have. I'm gonna make like an elevated garden bed out here in the swamps. Out here in the swamps. I guess it's more like the riverside. Hey, see, this will be beautiful. Let's plant some gourds, shall we? Uh oh. Controller's doing the thing again. I wonder if it's about to run out of power. Food! Gourd. You know what game I haven't played in a while that I really want, miss and want to play again soon? Fallout 4. Which has become one of my favorite games of all time. I used to think nothing could be better than Morrowind or New Vegas. But I think Fallout 4 has really started to overtake my, my favoritism. Also V-Rising. V-Rising is my other favorite game of all time now. Okay. Now we have a gourd garden. Yay! I always need more gourd. Should we put a fence around this? Kinda seems like we should put a fence around this, right? Oh, don't I have a brand new fence that I didn't claim? Let's try this brand new fence that I didn't claim yet. Seasons. This gives me a reason to claim it. Beach fence. Which is like the sanctuary fences from, you know, uh, Fallout 4. Speaking of Fallout 4, Teamage Flip says, I've been meaning to start a new Fallout 4 with some mods. I've never played it other than with vanilla. Dude, honestly, I've only played it vanilla 2 and I haven't even completed all the content. Like, I've beat the game three times, two times all the way, one time pretty much to the end. And I've only done one DLC, so I still have like four endings and three DLCs to do or something. Like, I have a lot of content I could still do. And that's after putting in like almost 2,000 hours. Sniperman Boss says it's hailing outside. Dude, it rained here really hard all day long. I have a straight up white picket fence. I didn't know that. Oh, 
Well, I'll tell you what, I didn't need that silly beachness then, or is this the beachness? It says white picket fence, it doesn't say beachness. There's no gate, you just have to jump over the fence. Oh wait, all of them have a gate. Weird. So it's just got gates everywhere. <laughs> Whatever. Oh, I just picked more gourd. Here, let's plant it. Beautiful. And while we're here, we should probably grab some of the coke. Delicious coke. Can I break into my own house? Yay. Haunted house, open door. How's everything going, Adelaide? Gateland! Snipey says, Purdy Fence. Thank you. While I'm here, I should take a nap because I'll get a longer bonus. But I wanted to do the thing for the challenge. It says, Scrap junk to produce screws. So I think we might be able to make bulk screws. Let's find out. Nope, bulk screws is not something you can make. Darn. Alright, well then we have to actually just go around and scrap junk. That means we have to go get more junk to scrap. Hi, Simothy! Do a nuki nuke! Maybe, maybe. How you doing? It's so good to see you. Imagine a muffin nuke. Talk about tasty. That would be good. Tasty, tasty. Sniper says, I've beaten Fallout 4 over 20 times. That's epic. What's your favorite ending? Hardy Heathen says, in here, I thought you was going to say Far Cry 6. I'm happy that you've been loving that game so much. I'm really excited for V Rising's full release. Also, by the way, everybody, V Rising just announced that they are raising the price when 1.0 comes out. So you guys have, like, Three or four days left to buy V Rising at the cheap $19.99 price if you don't already have it. And then it's going up to $34.99. So if you want $15 cheaper, get it now. It's about to do its full release. Which I'm excited about. I love it so much. That's like my favorite game. Did it say I already got my bonus? Some of you says, bye! Sniperman Boss says, Institute blowing up and the controller shakes. Yeah! So I've got Kindred Spirit now. Well, the scrapping screws is something I can't really control too much, but I can definitely go collect a death egg. Let's see if this one is there or if it's already been cleared out. We might have to go to a private server for this. Or we could re-roll that, because it might be really hard. If everybody's trying to get the Deathclaw egg at once. Hardy Heathen says, yeah, I've been enjoying it a lot. So far, just taking my time with it, though. I don't want to end it too quick, right? Well, I'm happy you're enjoying it.
there supposed to be a deathclaw egg somewhere in this nest? Well, maybe somebody already got it. Thank you for the lurk, hearty heathen heartness. Oh, I hope you have a nice date night. Super heartness, Valgar. Talk to you soon. Well, just as I feared, it might not be that easy to get an egg. everybody else wants it too. But at least I get some free ammo out of the deal. There's a lot of ammo over here. I didn't realize this place was so full of treasure, honestly. I have a permadeath girl that has an optional quest to come here, and I'm like, not really sure I'm going to, because I don't see what the point is. Although I could build myself an up high area and then kill the deathclaw. Then I would feel so cool. Be a big risk, though. If I mess up at all, I would die. Party Heathen says, yeah, for sure. I will be on in the garden discord once Crazy goes to sleep. Just hanging out in there. Okay, I'll do my best to try to go in there. I actually went in there like yesterday, I think, and tried to say hi to you, but I think you were AFK. I was in there for a while streaming. I've been a little bit hesitant to go in there because I've been playing permadeaths off stream and I'm afraid that if I'm talking to people it'll make me make a mistake and die. <laughs> but I'll, I'll just have to get brave. Alright, I think this is not gonna happen. So let's go ahead and re-roll this because it's too hard. Sell ribeye steak to an NPC vendor. That I can do. Also, we could go keep working on the gulp request. See if anybody's at the Gulper Lagoon right now. Oh, I'm over encumbered. I'm always over encumbered. I am over encumbered and cannot run. 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 Running out of fusion cores. Time to switch to stealth build. If you want me to recharge some of yours, I've got the charger. I could trade you for ones that I'm charging that are already charged or something. Just let me know. If you ever need to do that. I don't want to... I want to actually save the shovel because I don't think I have one. Food and drink and weapons and shovel favorite put in stash why am i carrying so many weapons i need to go to a railroad for real really badly Let's go to the railroad. Doo -ba -doo -ba -ba -doo -ba -doo -ba -doo. 
Let's go, let's go, let's go. Do, do, do. Lucas says, I have the charger, but no fusion cores. Just two on me. Oh, yeah. Well, that's good you have the charger, too. I've noticed I had to be really careful and super thoughtful about making sure I pull my batteries out so that they don't get used all the way up. It's easy to just go through them. Don't need this, and I don't need this, and I don't need this. And I don't need this, and I don't need this, and I don't need this. That's probably most of my weight right there. Anybody need ultracite plasma cores? Weapons. Let's sell this guy all the grenades. The grenades. Okay, much better. Wait, I can probably also sell you things like this food and drink that I don't need, and dog food. Gulper innards, melon bloom. I'll put that nuka cranberry in the donation box because I don't, I don't use that. Salisbury steak. Put the high radiation fluids in there too. Stealth Boy, Radix. I think I only need to take like half of this. Take the, ca the caps instead. Okay. Let's see. Food and drink. Cranberry. Nuka Cola. One, two, three. I forgot what the other thing I thought I was going to put in here is. Yeah, good enough. wonder if there's any junk around here that has screws in it. Don't see a lot of junk. Just at all. So let's continue on our way to the Gulper Valley. Gulper Lagoon! I love Gulper Lagoon. I like how the gulpers always hang from the trees here. Legendary gul gulpy gulper is gulping me. It's gultastic. <laughs> Any more gulpies around? Want to play? Part of the swamp might have some gulpies. Let's go see! Nobody's there to help. Come on everybody, it's time for Heart of the Swamp! Bye.
find the strangler heart. Let me put on my power armor for this. Cause I'm about to get mobbed. Let's turn down the sound of my chainsaw. Settings, audio, effects, one, two, three, four, five. It's much better when it's just a gentle hum. The Strangler Heart is calling for reinforcements! It is no longer accepting my damage. Oh no, my instigating flaming chainsaw has become brokey! Well, I'll fix my anti-armor chainsaw, because <laughs> that's the better chainsaw anyway. I was testing the instigating, and it's okay, but there's a noticeable difference on the anti-armor for sure. Hello, friends! from flap limb oh no I have flappy limbs like a bird I hope I don't accidentally fly away There's a giant lobster lady! Hello, giant lobster lady. You're looking nice today. Nice and delicious. I'm gonna eat lobster tonight. Once I treat my flap limb, Flap limb is making my damage a little less. Pardon me. I never liked moths that eat your clothes, Snipey says. Yeah. I actually don't mind bugs. I like bugs in real life, but moths are not a good one to have in the house because they destroy stuff that's cloth, you're right. I mean. I don't know if there's really a great bug to have in a house. Ironically, spiders are better than most because they eat the other ones. As long as the, it's a spidey that's not going to be aggressive towards people. Yay! Thumbs up all around! No gulpers, but it was still fun. So let's see, next I need to cripple a Protectron or a Robobrain's arm. That sounds like it's gonna take a really long time. What else could I do instead? K 
Kill a legendary creature times five. That'll be easy. Was the last one epic? Oops. Um, I can't remember if it was or not. It probably was, because otherwise, why would I have kept it? I'm not paying that much attention, I guess. Oops. I don't remember if it was or not. I'm just gonna tell myself it wasn't. It wasn't epic, don't worry. I mean, I guess since I did this to myself, I can try to draw for an epic now. Epic, 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 epic! Kill a Delth, Deathclaw, or Rad Scorpion. Yes! And it's only three, too. Okay, so... Heck, we might be able to do that at the next Mothman event, but... I think there's some... Deathclaws over here. At the top of the world. Let's go see! DMH Slip says the Protectron one isn't too bad if you go to Waitoga. Yeah. I mean, honestly, it's not bad. The main challenge I find is that I like to play on the same server as other people, and it seems like if it's something like where everybody has to get so many, it's so hard to do it unless you're on a private server. DMH flips his rad scorpions at Knife's Edge. Thank you for the tip. I actually don't recall where Knife's Edge is or if I've been there. I'm just walking in the air, you know, a normal day. I died for that queen. Then I was like, how? Then I realized, oh yeah, I'm not using power armor and crafting build is on me. That makes sense. Oh no. <laughs> I'm sorry, Lucas Rip. <laughs> Make sure you check your mutations or your mutant cards or whatever. Don't want to accidentally take those off. Blue Devil! This used to be where a Deathclaw was, but they replaced it with a Blue Devil. Hi, Wiggle Plays. Good to see you. How you doing? Wiggle Plays says, Inside a Robe Co. is instanced. Don't need to worry about other people taking the robot kills. That's a really good tip. And I go to Robo Co. a lot, I think. But I didn't even know you could go inside of it. So, um, that's interesting and I need to look at that. <laughs> I might be thinking of the wrong place. But if I'm thinking of the same place, then I don't know where how to get into it. Because I always just kill robots on the outside and then wish that there were more. Lucky for me, I just happen to feel like killing a blue devil today. Because it's fun! Hi, Super Moxie! Welcome! Thank you so much for coming by. It's so good to see you. Hope you're having a good day. And everybody, Wiggle Plays is, is also a YouTube creator. Please go give them a sub if you haven't already and show them some gardening love. Are you enjoying the new season pass so far, everybody? Oh no, anti-armor flaming chainsaw has been broken. It's okay, I come prepared. Chainsaw's really kind of a hard build to run non-stop unless you've stacked your repair kits, because it breaks fast, even with all the right cards. Woohoo! That was fun! Okay, now let's go look for the death claws. So let me see. While we're thinking of Robco, 
or Roboco. This is what I'm thinking of. Is this the same place? Yeah, so apparently I don't know how to get into that. I should go and look around because I didn't know there was an instanced event where you could kill robots in there. That would be very helpful to me. I just always walk around the outside. There's a cultist over here! I wonder if any of them are gonna have special goodies. It may surprise you to know that I'm dressed just like you under my power armor. I look just like you. Ah, run away! You can die! Thanks. This is your decision. Alright, well, I've got power armor. Thanks, though. Crash! I hope I'm going the right way. I feel like I'm a little off path. Yeah, this might be right. Yay, there's a death claw, just like I hoped. This is the one death claw where I know where it, it always is. Oh, and I guess there's one in Tunnel of Love, too. I think there's a couple in this Mothman event, if you're lucky. I'm lucky enough to be next to it when they spawn. Mothman event coming up in seven minutes. Hey, who are you guys? Settler craftsmen? What are you killing? Blood eagles, I bet. So, Knife's Edge, where is that for the rad scorpion? Ah! That was gory. You guys okay? You don't talk. You should give me money for killing them for you. Oh, bummer. Let's see if I can remember where Knife's Edge is. I honestly, like, that doesn't ring a bell, really. Bloody Franks, northeast of Crater. Thank you, Wiggle Plays. Oh, here it is, yeah. DMH Flip's already here. Dang. I have to drop my tent, too. Over-encumbered again. Oh, don't do that. Almost scrapped my helmet. Maybe I should scrap that from down here so I can see it better. The other monitor so far away from my eyes. I just started wearing contacts again and it's harder for me to see far away with them. It is legitimately like three feet away though or four feet away. That's kind of far to read the tiny little writing. Okay. Now I should be able to go. Thanks, DMH Flip. Lucas says, I've been there. Just with a left arm. Lol. <laughs> Rip T65 left arm. <laughs> Oh, Rad Scorpion! Whoa! Just like you said! Kill Glowing Creature. This is gonna count for two. Nice. Good tip, DMH DM Flip. Thank you. Forty-one! Woo! Uh, 
That was very cool. Then with time to spare. So what else do I have for today's dailies? I still have this screw one. I need to find stuff with a screw. Kill a mutant hound. I think sometimes there's mutant hounds down here. Okay, Lucas Hartness. Three minutes till the event. All public services in the city of Watoga were designed to be completely automated, including a full staff of security robots. I love that picture of Labyrinth and the Smiling Man. They both look like vampires standing on the road in their old-timey 1800s clothes. Wiggle Play says, Loot inside, wayward for screws, instance. Ooh, good idea. Thanks, Wiggle Plays. DMH Flip says, Huntersville. Okay. You all have any doggies? Here, doggy, doggy, doggy. I don't see any doggies today. I wonder if somebody else already got them. Usually there's three doggies here. Spread throughout the whole thing. Are you the insult bot? I have ended your reign of terror. There's some floaters over there. Maybe their pets are floaters today. I don't see any doggies here today. I really need to take care of my illness. It's affecting my AP. traveling please stand by Woohoo Join the wise mothman's enlightened in performing a summoning ritual Look to the rooftops for totems of warding Blood troves can be found in the streets look for orange banners Be sure to protect all the pyres Enemy waves will not relent. Don't forget to return to the museum rooftop before the wise one arrives. Testing my drill for a weapon. I wish it was a vampire. <laughs> Lucas says, reminder to myself, don't eat the plans, Lucas. Let me dress for the occasion. <laughs> Nothing like putting someone else's skull right over your face and going to a party.
I see DMH flip over here. I had to turn off the voices for this because it was just like constant talking and it also sounds really spooky too spooky for me i don't want to be too I mean, it's like i'm dressed up <laughs> as a cultist but other than that that's about as immersive as i want to get for this the whole thing's kind of gross but i do love the mothman so i guess it's worth it Sniper Man Boss says, Entering the wasteland with Dahlia with a chainsaw in her hand, and I know she has a plan as we travel with Honest Dan. We need to cook some food on a frying pan. Lucas is the man. I took a raider out with a fan. <laughs> I love it, Snivy. Another great rap about Fallout. <laughs> ah, crash. Destroy totems of warding, collect and deposit albino blood into the tro blood troves. Troughs. It's English is so weird. The fact that that is trough is strange. Observer Johanna. Hi. She's so goth, and she's like, I love the red against the albino skin. Like, you're a freak. You're a freak! I love you. Crash. I broke my hips as I'm eating all my plans. All right, all right. You tell us how it goes. I'm waiting till the 8th to eat all my plans. I don't think there's a right way or a wrong way. There's just a bugged way. <laughs> but in the end, it'll all even out. Especially if they do end up giving us an extra week of unbugged event. This is kind of a long event already, you know? We'll be tired of it by the end, but hopefully we'll all get everything we want. The fact that it's already longer than a week is kind of unusual. Interestingly enough, as I've been playing on and off since launch, and this is the first time that I've ever actually been playing for this event. Like, I've always missed it for break for some reason. This is the only event I hadn't played until... Like yesterday or the day before. Lucas says, we are trying, but the plans are so good! Also, I broke my hip. Welcome back. I'm happy to see you again. Hope you're doing well. Do you have any insight that you care to share on the changes from scoreboards to season passes? While I fly around the rooftops. Hey, there's some vertebrates over there, which I would care about if I didn't already have like a thousand freaking nuke cards. I need to launch more nukes and spend less time collecting cards. <laughs> but at least I always have them when I'm ready to go. I have to be, like, in a certain mood to launch nukes, and then when I do, I usually just keep doing them all day long. I haven't seen any aminals. Still need two more. La 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 la. Time to light the pyres. Defend the ritual pyres. Which one goes first?
Then certainly, I mean, the comment of don't eat the plants is a suggestion, not a rule. Do whatever's fun for you. Especially if it's something that you really, really want and you don't care about what else you get. Like, heck yeah, eat it. Whoa! Whoa! I'm flying! I'm the mayor. Ooh, you already have the fancy robe. You look great. I want that fancy robe. I love your Mothman glasses. Aww. You look so good. <laughs> the heretics are approaching the bridge pyre, which I don't know where that is, but I'm going to find it. With all the people over here, I'm gonna guess it's this way. Bridge pyre under attack! I think I'm still wearing my goat legs, right? Oh, I know what part of it is, is I think I have broken armor. My legs... have a... Um... A mod to make me have less fall damage, but I think that I may have forgotten to fix my armor. I broke my hip says thanks, and the new season is alright. I like the old seasons where every rank I was getting a reward, not having to pick and choose what I want. Don't make me choose, right? Well, well what I've found is that I end up just saving everything. Which I guess there's nothing wrong with that, right? It's different. So, one thing I do really like about it, though, is that now there's a way for people who don't want to buy Fallout first to still be able to get all the items. So, I appreciate that. I think that that's a good idea. But I'm with you. It was I kind of liked just getting a random thing. Like, I have mixed, I have mixed feelings about it, because in some ways I'm like... I like being able to just save up for the thing I want and then buy the thing I want, but on the other hand, since I have a choice, I'm unlikely to try to even claim the stuff I don't care about. <laughs> Whoa, I'm going so high! Good thing I reset, I thought I was gonna freaking die for sure. I love going so high that I reset. Now I'm not even... That's a glitch. Kind of a fun glitch. Because I was going to say, I'm not even using my rocket pack and it's just throwing me higher. I broke my hip says they still charge tickets though, which is weird, and hey Silver, I'm good, thanks. Oh no! Is the game freezing or is my OBS freezing? It seems like it might be the game. I'm getting all sorts of freezies on my PC today. I'm in the air! Woo! <laughs> Perform merriment atop the roof of the museum. Okay, I need a AP for this. <laughs> Help! <laughs> I died next to the Mothman. I am the sacrifice, I guess. Help! Help! Can you guys not see me? Help! Thank you. Whew. 
They're like, nah, you're the sacrifice. <laughs> the game chose me when it threw me up into the air. It's scary. Got a couple more to finish. I love this event. I think this event's interesting. So let me see what I got for notes. The plans are what I really care about, typically. I got Cultist Incarnate Helmet and Mothman Equinox Souvenir Beer Stein, which I think I've gotten three of so far. I was looking at a list of that stuff, but I forget which one that was. Good job, everybody! Y'all rock! Now, let me see what I have left for my dailies. Sell ribeye to an NPC vendor. And scrap junk to produce screws. I'm mad enough about... Oh, wait, somebody said Huntersville, so I could do that. I think two of these things I can do by wayward. I can't fast travel. I'm carrying too much. I'm a hoarder. What can I say? Ow. Never mind. I will abandon my stuff. That's what I get for being a hoarder. Res at Wayward. Oh, I can't res at Wayward. Why not? Weird. Here, let's res right here. I broke my hip, says the beer mug can't be dropped or traded, so you could learn that one you got and void the others. Rip. Right. Well, I mean, so I, one version of the bug that I heard, and so I, all I know is that a bug has been confirmed by Bethesda, but I honestly don't know because it's like there's a couple of rumors about what the bug actually does going around. One version of the bug that I heard is that after you eat an item, if you are... If the game wants to give you that item again, but you've already known it, the bug is, instead of giving you something different, it just gives you nothing. So that's why people are saying don't eat the plans, because otherwise you might receive nothing as a present. Because, like, it, the way it's supposed to work is it gives you an alternative. Right? Is that good? Let's go back down to Wayward. I'm over encumbered! And I cannot run! But I'm hungry and I have food. Cord soup, glowing meat steak, glowing fungus soup, fire bat cracker berry juice, death claw steak, Cranberry relish, corn soup. Oh, I need to sleep again, don't I? Because I died. Yay, friend request received! Thanks, Wiggle Runner. Let's be friends. Woohoo! Yay! So, Wiggle, have you heard about the permadeath server that is trending on Twitch right now, started by a Twitch streamer named Comrade Vanya, and it's a community project with a custom-built world that's set to difficult, like everything's set to difficult, and then the rule is if you die you have to start over. It's been really fun, I've been playing on it. I highly recommend for anybody who loves challenges. 
There's a link to it in my Twitch chat. I don't have a link to it here right now. If you were interested, though, or if anybody's interested, just let me know and I'll get the information for you. Otherwise, I might have the information built in if I bring that here to YouTube. For the time being, though, I'm not sure if I will because I don't want it to be con confusing comparing my hardcore run, which has actually been going on since August, with me running on this permadeath server. The permadeath server just got started in March, so my hardcore run is like a much older thing that I've been doing. Wiggle Place says, I haven't heard about it. It's really cool. I like it. Um, let me put the Discord in the chat for anybody who's interested. I'll just pop over to my Twitch real quick and copy what it says. But it's been really fun, and I think the funnest thing, like, for me particularly, I have always, so not always, but like for the last few years, I've been really into challenge runs across different games. Like, I've successfully completed Survival Fallout 4 on Permadeath, and I've done a bunch of Permadeath runs in Skyrim, and I've been doing the Hardcore run here on of Fallout 76 on YouTube, which is, by the way, a permadeath and um, hardcore are the same thing. It's just that it's popular to call it hardcore on YouTube, and it's popular to call it permadeath on Twitch. But I've, like, I've... I, Yesterday, I just got to 59, and I joined the Enclave on my hardcore run, so... Like, this is something I've been into for a long time. So when I heard about a different server to participate in doing the same thing that was also competitive, and there's a leaderboard and stuff, of course I had to do it. I was so excited. Looks like I have to break this into two messages... Actually, I have to break it into three messages. I should just put this in... Um, my description, if I'm going to keep doing this. So yeah, that's the information about it. Once you're dead, you start over with a new character at level 2. Standard perks only, no legendaries, negative 25% carry weight, no vats, plus 25% AP cost, hard NPC difficulty, plus 200% damage, additional loot drop, plus 25% core drain, disable fast traveling, no teams, no fallout first, scrap boxes, ammo boxes, survival tents, you are allowed to use things that you've earned in the game, like on the scoreboard or something. So you're not, they don't take away from you stuff that, that you've learned, that you've earned, but just no like tent or scrap box or ammo box, which is kind of a pain, but you can use your shelter, so then you kind of end up using your shelter like the camp. Thank you so much for following me, text. I'm Dahlia. Wiggle Play says, that sounds fun. I highly recommend it. There's about, I think there's like pushing 70 people in the Discord right now. It is starting to trend. That's why I was wondering if you knew about it or not. Like, because it's been pretty cool. And anybody who's into that sort of challenge, I definitely recommend joining the Discord, getting more information about it. Like I said, um, I'm. it's not actually my project. I'm a community member and I'm a server host for it. So I have gotten involved in it, but Comrade Vanya over on Twitch is actually the person who started it. It's been super fun. Like, especially adding that competitive aspect 
where you can really like go up against other people and see how you fare is really fun. I've loved that, especially as like somebody who's been doing permadeath runs for years. I like to be like, well, how good am I really though? You know what I mean? Compared to all these other people, at least one person's gotten into the 80s. I think they may have died in the 80s. And now they're trying to push back up, but yeah. Pretty impressive. And DMH Flip says it's about time for me to drop anyway. I hope you all have a good night and see you soon. I'm so sorry I didn't see that and with the delay it probably feels like it's been forever if you are still here. But thank you for playing and I love uh, playing with you so hopefully I'll see you again soon DMH Flip. Heartness, I hope you have a really good night. Hey, Lorik! Hi! I was just wondering about you the other day because I haven't seen you in some days. Did you have a good Easter? Hi, I'm back. Siloric is back and not able to get into Twitch because I need an app to regain access to my account, but I would have to pay to use the app. Okay, well, fair enough. Welcome back, Keyloric. Sorry that you had to change your name. That's always frustrating. And I'd definitely be weary of anything where it says you have to pay to use it. That sounds like a scam. Or just, if it's something that they claim is required to access a otherwise free service, then that sounds like a scam. So, good on you that you didn't do it, I guess. So let's see what's in here. Also, I think that there's... I can get some steak. Don't kill me, Bessie! Oh, I meant to actually scrap. Just need to scrap. And then cook. Hopefully, Duchess will buy this steak. I've noticed actually, especially in the permadeath, that she doesn't buy a lot of stuff. Okay, Lorik says, I missed you so much. I missed you too. Welcome back. I'm sorry that you went through that trouble, but I'm happy that you made it in. Ribeye steak. This is what I want. It's Locke Glen. I don't know you, but you look cool. You also look over encumbered. <laughs> Super Moxie, thank you so much for becoming a member and welcome. I hope you enjoy all the benefits of membership, which include members only streams, lots of member only videos, a heart on the wall of heartness, and some cool emotes made by me. So, let's get you up on the Wall of Heartness. I think you're going to be the second person of the month. That's very exciting. Thank you, thank you for the so support and love. Let me get you... I'm going to go with blue. How about a blue heart? Dink. Thank you, thank you. If anybody else is wondering how you would become a member, all you have to do is push the join button. It's kind of not super intuitive because it's like join, join what? But if you press join, you'll see a video about membership and different options in case you're interested in checking it out. Thank you so much, Super Moxie Heartness. Super Moxie. GT69. 
YouTube member. Big heart. Woohoo! Let's get you up on the wall of heartness. Let's see where it fits the best. Super Moxie says, love the channel. Been watching ever since. Keep it up. Aw, thank you so much, Super Moxie. It really is encouraging and means a lot to me to hear you say that. Thank you. Keylorik says, having internet problems, Dahlia. Oh no, Keylorik. I hope your internet comes back. It's been real rainy here. I'm actually pretty lucky that it didn't create problems for me. Because usually when it rains a ton... It's very problematic for me. But not today, I guess. So that was lucky. Thank you so much for gifting a holographic membership to Super Moxie. Aww, you brought Crazy Little Monster into the hologram fam. Thank you for your incredible generosity. Woohoo! Labyrinth says, now I got my own Mothman throne. Awesome, Labyrinth. So I've got this for your membership, and let's get one for the membership that you gifted as well. This one will be yellow for contrast, I think. No more spinning. I don't like it when you spin. Stop it, little cultist girl. No spinning. Just hang out with that Assaultron. So tomorrow night I am going to be here again a little bit after 6 o'clock. Running till about 8-ish again. That's, that's my typical time... A little bit after 6 to a little bit after 8. Sometimes I try to do a hard stop on 8. It depends on what I've got going on in my personal life. But I'll be back tomorrow. I don't know if it's going to be regular just playing with everybody and doing the Mothman event. Or if I might possibly do a hardcore day or if I might do the permadeath day. All I know for sure is that it's going to be Fallout 76. I broke my hip says it's snowing here. Where do you or do you care to share a general region of which you live? I broke my hip. No pressure if that makes you uncomfortable. I used to live in Colorado and it snowed way too much for my taste. I'm happy to be in Florida now. One gift membership. Woohoo! On YouTube. So you get a yellow heart and a blue heart. Keyloric says, as that Assaultron stares at you. Yeah, you never know. She might at some point just like go rogue and start attacking everyone. <laughs> I just want to take a moment again to say thank you so much to everybody for liking the stream. It means a lot to me. And welcome to all the new subs. And welcome to all the new members. Y'all rock. It means a lot that you have chosen to spend some time here during the Mothman event with me. Thank you for subbing Outlander1321. I'm Dahlia. Nice to meet you. So let's see how this should go on the wall of hearts. I think this one goes like this. And this one goes down in the middle to make it very heart-like. And then the rest of them are going to go out like this. Does that sound good? Heartness, thank you so much. Good start to the month. Very good start to the month indeed. See what we've got going on in here. I broke my hip. Says Canada. I live just outside Toronto. Cool. Sounds cold. Sounds like it should be cold though. 
So let's see, what the heck would have screws in it? It's you, my friend, Smiley. Speaking of Smiley, I keep forgetting to turn in my treasury notes. I just am stacking them up. What else do you have in here? Hot plate, maybe. This thing looks like it might have screws. Clean pepper mill. Undamaged cigarettes. I never noticed she had undamaged cigarettes before. Some of this stuff might have it. What about over here? Oh, that fan definitely has some. Super Moxie says, I met this channel when it was at 7 to 800. The grind to 1.2 is crazy grinding. For real, Super Moxie. Thank you so much for acknowledging that. Yeah, the first thousand subs were the most difficult. I can honestly say, because I started out on Twitch, and I was... I, I definitely think it's way harder to get subs on YouTube than it is to get followers on Twitch. Like... It was a real, real grind to to get to a thousand, and then after that, I've been a little, I've been a little bit more laid back about it, and it seems like it flows at an even pace as long as I keep making good content. But that first thousand was killer. Iron Man Duck, hi, how are you? Everybody, Iron Man Duck is also a creator here on YouTube and on Twitch. He makes very unique and creative streams. Super entertaining, definitely worth a look. Sniper Man Boss says, I'll take those smokes off her hands. Here you go, Snipey. <laughs> Did you hear the Ark Survival Ascended has a bug that erases your game saves? Oh no. I didn't hear that. Is that the new arc? I was playing the one that was like the copy of the original a few months ago. I I was playing that, but I know everybody was saying they were going to release a completely different version. And I don't know the difference between all the names, to be honest. I got really into Pal World, which is like a copycat of arc, but... To me, when I was playing Ark, I found it really fun to just be like naked jungle lady and run through the jungle run running from dinosaurs trying not to die. I thought that was super duper fun, but actually playing the game the way I was supposed to, I was like, meh. <laughs> Aw, heartness, Snipey. That means a lot to me. What do I have left here in dailies? Oh yeah, I forgot to sell the ribeye steak to Duchess. Silly me. Silly me. I hope she buys it. What if she doesn't even buy it? That'd be annoying. <laughs> <laughs> Sniper says, and your character was pooping a lot from all the berries. Yeah, that's true. I didn't know that that was a part of Ark. And it surprised me. I don't usually do potty humor, so like my whole community was like laughing so hard because you could tell it really bothered me that my character was going to the bathroom. <laughs> I was like, ah, why? Super Moxie says, I was taking a break from my side to show some love. I haven't seen the hearts in the way. Alive in a long time from being busy, but keep it up. Thank you so much. It means the world to me. I'll keep trying. I'm doing some extra this week. Like, so I always am live on Tuesday unless there's some emergency or something why I can't. That's my one day that's guaranteed. I'm often live on Monday, and then this week I'm doing Wednesday and Thursday just because 
I'm excited about the Mothman event, but... I am trying to stream more. It's like, it's a balance. It's such a balance, because when you're streaming, you don't have time to actually edit videos. So I go through periods where I'm, like, streaming a lot less and trying to edit a video, and then I... Ha then when I'm done with my video, I'm like, yeah, now I'm gonna stream extra! Woo! Hi, Big J! Welcome! It's so great to see you! How you doing? Big J is also a content creator here on YouTube. He's pretty chill. Please go check him out and say hello. He does gaming, and he also has a podcast. How have you been, Big J? Sniper Man Boss says, character was defecating all over the place. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that, that happened. Oh, Lord. Rank 44. What, what? Alright, so what do I have left? Build a piece of power armor, I think? Or scrap a piece of power armor. Build to scrap. Build the scrap. Build the armor, you know it's crap. Craft a, or scrap a piece of power armor. So where's the closest power armor? I think the closest power armor is here. Heartness Super Moxie! So, Super Moxie, let's see here. Super Moxie's also a creator, everybody. So, make sure that you go check them out and subscribe. I had to double check because it's been a while since I talked to you. I'm really happy you came back. Thanks for popping back in again. Sniper Man Boss says... When your character did that, I thought someone in your chat was doing a redeem. Because <laughs> it was just too funny. Yeah, can you imagine, like, on... What's it called? Crowd control or something? Dude, crowd control on ARC. Ugh, that could get messy. I'll take that fusion core and one piece of power armor. Dink! Done and done. Maybe I should just clear the whole thing so that... It can reset for someone else. Weird. I, I actually have to enter it to collect it. Annoying. Big J says, how is everyone tonight? Doing good. How about you, Big J? How about you? Keylorx says, do you play Power World, Dahlia? Because I play it sometimes. I love Power World. I honestly haven't had time to play it lately. I've been so busy with other games that are take, taking priority, but I do love Pal World. I think, I mean, I'm pushing 40 on it, so I'm getting close to the end of leveling on my main world. But I was playing it really non-stop for like a month when it first came out, and then I got back into just playing mostly Fallout 76 again. And I know V Rising's coming out again soon too. Like, so once V Rising is re-released, that's gonna take a lot of my time. I love V-Rising so much. <laughs> Snivy. <laughs> You're hilarious. Let's see. What do I have left? Just kill some dogs, right? And I think this is going to be the last thing I do and then we'll find somebody to redirect to because I believe my dinner is done and it's time for me to eat. But I'm going to be back tomorrow. 
And if you guys join the Discord, I'm going to be in the Discord streaming the permadeath server later. So if you feel like coming and watching and seeing what that's like, the link to the Discord is in the description below, as well as links to all my other socials. So I'd love to connect with you on whatever it is you're already using. Let's fast travel over to Huntersville, which I think is... There's Summersville. Hmm, where's Huntersville? Huntersville? No. Where's Huntersville? Does anybody remember? I forgot. I don't go there very much. Oh, here we go. Yay. I got lucky. Lucas says, dang it, there goes another plan! <laughs> But yeah, Keyloric, we should definitely get together on Pal World on Xbox sometime. I have a world with Turtle. You'd be welcome to join us. So I play... My main world is on PC, the Steam version, but I also have a world on Xbox. Keyloric says, have a great rest of your night, Dahlia. Also, enjoy your food. Bye. Super heartness, Keyloric. Thanks for being here. I'll see you soon, I hope. Have a good night. Time to kill a mutant hound. One! You look so weird with that little gun. Super Mutant Warlord has tiny gun. Doesn't make sense. It doesn't make sense at all. One more. Yay! Cultist High Priest. Can I get one more doggy, please? Eyeballs everywhere. Keylorg says, oh yeah, bye, Gur. Gur says bye, Heartness. Gur's my puppy for anybody that doesn't know. He's very cute. I don't see a third dog. Because... Two is too few, and four is too many. Three dog! Stardew Valley new major update 1.6 allows up to eight players now. Nice! I love that. There's definitely been times that I wanted to play with multiple people. I never really got that into the game. I was kind of getting into it. I had a family member that lives in Colorado that was trying to teach me how to play, and it was kind of cool because we could play from like 2,000 miles away together. But then we both kind of like got distracted with our lives and didn't, didn't really keep up with our farm together. Plus, she's like an expert at it, and I don't really know how to play, so she, she was like doing the most of everything. I just need one more doggy, but I don't think it's here. I think the doggy is gone. I have to think of another place where a doggy would be. 
Not just any doggy, a super mutant doggy. Oh, West Tech is a place that a doggy would be. Okay, I'll go to West Tech. Oh no, a bomb! Oh, no, 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 don't destroy the ritual bindings. It's the only time ever since I picked them up that I actually wanted to wear them is this week. I remember a long time ago there used to be dailies like, wear ritual bindings and kill a frog. And it's like, they stopped doing that though. <laughs> Be a weird cultist and do cult shit. That's basically the daily quest back then. Alright, so where's the West Tech Center? Am I over encumbered? No, amazingly. Amazingly not. <laughs> you hungry for some 200 year old Salisbury steak or you hungry for some news? I'm guessing news. <laughs> I'm hungry for some mutant chop hounds. Hound chops. Mutant hound chops. Mutant hound chops and I don't care. 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 Oh, so many splodies. It's okay, I have explosion proof armor. Mutant hound chops and I don't care. Mutant hound chops and I don't care. Mutant hound chops and I don't care. Yay, there it is. I did it. I did my dailies and I reached rank 44. Woo! Success! Now I can run away from all these mean super mutants. They wish me harm! Well, I'm so close to 30... to 305. Let's just... Let's just finish this off. Ah! <laughs> ah! <laughs> I just need to kill a couple more things. I might have to go inside just to get that that last level. I broke my hips as back in my day, dailies gave Adams. Oh yeah, I remember that. That was nice. That was a nice time in our lives. Snipey says, hi, Lucas with a minigun. Heck yeah. Woo, I did it. 305. I'm good. I just wanted to finish off that level. I don't actually want to run West Tech right now. I want to go eat my fish. Fish and Sally. Time for dinner. Let's see if there's anybody cool that's also streaming Fallout right now. <laughs> so, I'll give priority to somebody streaming Fallout. If I don't know anybody right now that's streaming Fallout, we'll raid somebody streaming something else. Uh oh. No, everything's good. Alright, everything is great. My controller's working still. Right? Controller, are you working still? Yes. Let me go escape to somewhere where I can pop my tent. 
do a little bit of inventory management so I don't end up like today just so over encumbered I can't move at the beginning. That's the worst. Hi, Wolfsten. Good to see you. I'm happy to know you've been hiding here in the shadows. Marty is streaming. Is Marty the, the real name of somebody I would know by something else? He has a good channel and could use some love. Is he streaming Fallout 76? Because I'm honestly not against going to somebody new. Especially if they're streaming Fallout 76. Because the thing that I've found is that I only know like three people that stream Fallout 76 at the time I end. <laughs> so I definitely need to spend some time like after immediately after stream that's the tough part right it has to be immediately after stream to see the people that'll line up and follow some more people wolf's den says i like to lurk a bit he is okay that sounds good i will figure out his i think i have to go subscribe to him real quick before it'll let me raid him and then it, I've never tried to do it on the fly like this. Assuming that it allows me to, I will. Okay, so I can at least move. So she's safe there. Let me check out this channel that you're talking about. Because for real, I have pretty much raided everybody I know repeatedly <laughs> that plays Fallout 76. Subscribe! Yeah! Okay, this sounds fine. This, this is a good tip. Thank you for the tip. We will be going into Marty's for the raid. Um, I'm gonna just go over a couple more things real quick to say goodbye. First of all, thank you so much for being here and spending some time with me. I hope you had as much fun as I did. If you haven't already, please don't forget to like the stream and subscribe to the channel so we can hang out again soon. Also, check out the join button and watch the weird little video I made. See if you want to be a member. I'm going to be back here tomorrow after 6 p.m. playing Fallout 76. And I'll be on Discord tonight after dinner playing the permadeath server if anybody wants to come check it out and see what it's like. Although I may have it so that I am not actually talking to people very much, just letting you guys watch. Because, like, I don't know if talking to people a lot is going to make me distracted and possibly die. So I'll play it by ear, but I might do something where, like, I mute hearing other people talk and then you guys can just watch my stream. We'll see how that goes. Don't forget to check out the links in the description below for the Discord, for my Twitch channel, for my other socials, and I'd love to connect with you wherever you are. And let's go check out Marty61Plays, assuming... I'm watching his stream right now, assuming that he's gonna stay live. Looks like he's fixing something. Alright, let's do this. It should be fine. When we get there, please don't don't forget to put hologram redirect because YouTube only announces that a redirect is happening for about five seconds, and if you don't uh, see that five see that message in the five seconds that it's up as a streamer receiving the redirect, you won't even know it's happening. So if everybody spams hologram redirect, it really helps a lot. Because then they know what's going on and that they're for sure getting a raid. Or a redirect. So let's make sure that YouTube will let me redirect to them. I was wondering, okay, maybe if I refresh this page, because yeah, I was, I'm like, it's a little bit different than Twitch. Like in Twitch, you actually write in where you want to go. On YouTube, you have to pick a channel that you're subscribed to, to redirect to. And that's why I was wondering if it was going to 
be somehow difficult for me to subscribe to the person moments before I try to redirect to them. Like if it was going to create some sort of a weird issue. And sadly, it doesn't look like he's showing up for me. I bet he'll show up for me next time, Wolf's Den, so please feel free to suggest him again next time, because I did subscribe to him, so by next time I'm streaming, he should be there. But I don't see him right now, so he's not an option for tonight. But I do see that my friend Cortra just came up, and he's also streaming Fallout 76, so we'll go there. I'm sorry for the disappointment. I tried, but yeah, YouTube just hasn't caught up, so we'll do it next time. Just remind me, okay, Wolfsten? All right, everybody. So don't forget hologram redirect in the chat, and I will see you all tomorrow after six. Have fun, Heartness.